Hey there guys, it's Sarah from Sarah Soldiers coming to you from Ronald Reagan International Airport in Washington DC. And so I left Korea about a week and a half ago and I was supposed to make a video about like the end of my journey and everything and tell you guys what I was doing. However, when I did make it to the airport, I was a total mess, I was like crying. It was and I only had 20 minutes to board because my bags got held up in security. So I felt like that wasn't really a good idea. But anyway, I spent the last week um, back at home in the States. I spent a couple of days at Georgetown, which is where I go to school normally. And then I went home for about a week. And now I'm leaving the country again, but this time to go to China. So I've never actually been to China. I went to Taiwan last summer, if you've seen any of my videos about that. However, I have not really been practicing my Chinese in at least like eight months, so I'm kind of nervous. Um, I'm going to be going to a school called BLCU, or which is Beijing Language and Culture University. So I'm pretty excited to be doing this because I was originally supposed to go to Beijing uh, to study at Beida, or is, which is uh, Beijing University. However, if I were to do that through a program at Georgetown, it would cost me like $15,000 at least. Whereas the program that I'm doing right now, which is literally in the same area, and they produce the textbooks that Beijing University uses for the language instruction, it's like $1,000. So if your school doesn't support you in your study abroad goals, take, uh, just consider the possibility of like taking a semester off and just going on your own, which is what I'm doing in China. Um, I'm probably not gonna get credit for it, but I'm already gonna, by the time I graduate, I'll have taken seven credits, or uh, seven classes worth of Chinese anyway, so I'm still gonna be able to minor in it. My main goal is just to like get good at the language, and I think that spending time in the country with the people, really immersing myself is the best way to do that. So yeah, that's what I'm currently doing. I'm gonna be boarding in about an hour, so I'm just trying to kill some time. But yeah, so, that's what's going on in my life. Sorry for not keeping you guys updated better. Because I'm like, I'm not great at this whole YouTube thing. Because, I don't know, things have been really crazy. But I really appreciate you guys who have stuck with me, regardless of the fact that I'm not super consistent with uploading videos. So thank you for spending time watching this video. Oh, and also, if you want to see all my adventures in China and around the world, you can follow me on Instagram at Sarah Soul Search. It's the same spelling as my channel username, so you probably won't have any trouble finding it. Um, and I do have a VPN, so I will be able to use my social media, uh, YouTube, Instagram, etc. while I'm in China, so don't worry about that. Alright, so I'm gonna find my place at my gate and just kind of rest for a little while before I get on my flight. So thanks for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the comment section very soon. All right, bye.